Hello Vinegar fam, today we have something so exciting to share with you. But first, before we get to that, let's first get some caffeine in our body and chat about, guess what? what? Commitments. Ooh girl, I'm excited, Ooh. let's go. Our financial commitments are a lot like relational commitments. When you look after them, they get better over time. So today with the help of Nedbank, we are going to give you some tips to be responsible with your credit obligations so that you get to enjoy the long-term benefits. Washing the dishes has taught me so much about financial health, but let me explain. You see, it's like these dishes. If I just leave them and don't sort them out, pretending like they don't exist, they're going to pile up and it's going to get overwhelming. And at the end of the day, my wife-to-be is going to assess me. Now, similar to bills, if you don't have commitment to get your bills paid or to make a plan to get them paid, your credit score is going to assess you. Having a good credit score is so important because you'll have more flexibility in the future. When I was younger, I remember when I opened up my very first bank account, my father would always say to me, to measure is to know. And this statement really didn't make much sense at the time and I always used to just roll my eyes. But as I've gotten older, I've realized the importance of having a budget. Drawing up a budget has just really helped me prioritize my spending. It is really, really imperative that you pay your important expenses first, like your bills, debit orders, medical aid, that type of stuff. And then of course, with the rest of the budget, when you have stuff left over, you get to pay yourself, you get to invest, and then have a little bit of fun, because why not? Having a budget ensures that you pay your debts on time, because you prioritize them. It's just like the laundry. If you leave it, it'll pile up. Make sure that you pay your debts on time. It makes sure that your debts aren't piling up. It helps with financial stress. This also really can help with your credit score. And did you know that if you want to check your credit score, you can use the Nedbank Money app anytime and it's completely for free. And be like a fam, I think one of the most important tips that I can never leave out, especially when we are talking about finances, is the fact that if you are struggling to pay your monthly installments, it is so important to reach out to your creditors. With Nedbank, they have people that are willing to assist you so that they can restructure your payment plan so that you don't feel like your head is almost underwater. Don't try and hide the debt away. Don't try and hide away the fact that you actually aren't able to make these payments. It is as simple as contacting the creditor, telling them about your situation, and they'll restructure it to make it easier for you. This year, we want to be really, really responsible because when we're responsible now, we get to enjoy our finances later on in the future. So let's get back to working. Becca fam, if you enjoyed these tips, you're gonna love the Nedbank Money app. You can read short articles on the blog, download helpful infographics, and check your credit score for free as many times as you like. Finished for today with all our financial advice. We are actually planning our wedding tasting. So in the next video, we are gonna be doing all the wedding tasting things we cannot wait to show you. So if you love this type of content, like, subscribe, and of course, join the Bianca fam. We'll see you guys soon. Love you guys.